There's Domi saying for the win. Friends of YouTube, do me FTW coming at you once again with another fantastic casual card opening. But today it's not so casual because we are finally opening our premium All Elite Wrestling 2021 Spectrum, the first ever upper deck AEW, uh, I would say elite set. If you catch my draft, you know what I mean? Seven premium cards, premium per pack. Guaranteed, what, three hits? I think it sits over here. Three hits in every box on average, right? So we might get two, we might get four. Whew, I'm a little shaky for this one, not going to lie. This was an expensive box. I think one of the more expensive ones that I, I've picked up on this channel here. Naturally, just opening this up from, well, right after the Sports Cards Expo. So it's fun to open this one. Beauty right here. I usually say, no, not, let's not wasting time, but I'm not wasting any time. I'm just... Relishing in the moment right now, like just hoping for some magic from this one. Small box, definitely a, a premium pack. Whew, am I ready for this? I don't even know. But well, we're not wasting any time. Let's just dive into it. As you know, we do open cards with our bare hands here. Oh, how am I going to make this happen? All right. Whew. Calm down, don't be. You're a professional. Let's make it rain, baby. Let's make it happen. I think what I'm going to try to do is open it up discreetly on the back here and reveal cards one by one. Okay. That's the sealed side. From what I've seen, I want to just open up this side here. How am I looking on the camera? Am I good? Yeah, half decent. Well, we out here. Got the pack. Woo. She hefty. I hope it's not damaged, man. I've seen some videos out there and it's not been pretty. But I'm hoping for the best. From the Sports Card Expo. Uh, aid, um, sorry, Upper Deck had a great, great showing. So, Upper Deck. I love Upper Deck. <laughs> I just hoping for the best from this one here. All right. What would be the best way to open this beauty? What do you think? Directly from the top, professionally. Bare hands. Nice and easy. Come on, calm down, man. Okay, we're sealed. We're unsealed, I mean. We're going to try to open this in the back here and reveal one by one. up the box too much. I grabbed my blaster box just as a, uh, you know, kind of like a cover, you know what I mean? All right. I think we have them out here. First card. I don't know if you guys can see it. Nope, I got it pretty covered. So that's beautiful. And as you can see, I have Eddie beside me here. Very special day. 17 years to one of the greats left us been getting emotional thinking about it remember exactly where i was and when it happened oh just the wrestling was never the same after that if you know you know not just the mic skills and the charisma but that he was just so smooth okay well you know this is another reason why we're getting into aw here this is kind of like moving on and getting into bigger better things and hoping for the best with aw and for the future stars out there, hopefully like Eddie. All right, so our first card from the back here is... Yeah, baby! That's what I need right now. Oh, talk about charisma, smoothness, and mic skills. We have... Adam Cole! Oh, 
you know, you know, it's a baby at the end there. That's a beaut. Very, very pleased that this is our first card. Oh, Dom, don't screw this up. Wow, I'm shaking like a leaf. It's because I love Adam Cole. Come on, get in here. I think I might have to use a different uh, point on this one here. Oh, shoot. You know what? Let me stick to the bigger ones just because. Oh, wow. This set's too premium for me, man. I'm not built for this. I am not built for this. Why am I shaking at Adam Cole just base set? Oh, man. That's a beautiful thing right there. I'm going to put him right beside Eddie. All right, give the hands a rub. Shake it down. We got all our sleeves. We have all our stuff just ready for this opening. Oh, and I'm banging into my camera. Or I'm losing it, my people. I am losing it. Okay. Next card from the back here. Don't get too excited. Okay, we got the butcher. It's all right. Heavy Metal Mans. And saw him live in Toronto twice. So that guy was putting in work. You wouldn't believe. Less shakes on the butchers there, so. You know what I can, uh, I'll tell you, you can tell the caliber of how great the card means to me by how, my, how much my hands are shaking. <laughs> Next one on the back here is, okay, Scorpio Sky, base. Massive respects to Scorpio Sky. Mm. Former TNT champion. One of the OGs, AEW, and still around today. If you know, you know. Scorpio Sky from SCU. Great faction. But they're just kind of doing their own thing right now. So we got our three base cards. We have four cards left. This card here is. All right. Spectrum Liva Bates. Liva Bates. 67 out of 99. Um, yeah, is she cool? Awesome, whatever, but um, not what we were looking for for the Spectrum, but that's okay. And being that it's gold and out of 99 is a good thing. I'll sleeve her up right there. I think a 75 point will do. Should I even bother, like, given how my hands are right now? Yeah, I guess so. We're going to give it a shot. I think 75 is just fine. Oh, and now we're getting to the juice. There's three cards left. Let's make it happen. Okay. Malachi Black. Base. And he's making a return as well, so you love to see this. But a nice Malachi Black. You're going to give it the 130. Malachi Black, also known as Alistair Black, Black from, you know, back in the uh, not-so-great days, but now what he's got going on for him, and if you see his Pro Bowls, they're actually crazy, you know what I mean? The whole Black family, it's very, very dark, lots of tats, my friend. What killed me about the WWE is that they were doing the same Pro Bowls, beautiful cinematic Pro Bowls for this guy, and then that's it, they just cut, that's all. This might have to go over to Conti at some point, but that's okay. If you can see, two, two cards left. Let's get it. Really delaying what we can get here. Last card. Ethan Page, Canadian, on the mat. Spectrum. Not numbered, not numbered. Oh, shoot, I hope I didn't mess that up there. But it is an Ethan Page. I don't think I have one that's big enough for this, do I? I might. Oh, boy, oh, boy. I had the pleasure of seeing Ethan Page live in Toronto as well. And, man, the man's got skills. Not only in the ring, but he's got a future on the mic and behind the scenes. Just can't make it happen with the sleeve right here. Just ruining the card in front of my viewers. Come on, Ethan, get in there, man. There you go. 
oops oh wow there goes the inner wheel uh, the inner window <laughs> oh she fitted this one No, nah, I'm not going to give this a shot. It's just too tight. That's all right. The Ethan Page, last one. I mean, second last one, sorry. And last card here out of the bunch, we have... Chris Statlander. Memorabilia. Looking good. Not a numbered one, though, eh? This was a tough box just because there's not too many numbered things. Uh, except for the, uh, Liva Bates, which is all right. This is a good box, though. Like, in terms of Malachi Black and Adam Cole, two great hits. Scorpio Sakai and the Butcher as well. Originals, Chris Stadlander, who's injured right now, but as part of that Orange Cassidy best friends clan, so it's lovely to see. But I think the main feature from this one is going to be this on-the-mat Ethan Page Ladies and gents, if you love this video, throw me a like. If you love, if you really, really love this video and want to see more AEW out of me here, maybe subscribe to the channel because I, I love the brand. I love opening Upper Deck AEW stuff just because it's, it's nice stuff. But as always, Domi FTW coming out for the win, fresh from the Sports Card Expo. Peace out, everybody. Hope you're having a great day and take care. AEW.